turret gunners were shooting into the ground and the AUP were shooting their AK-47s into the ground. Uh, it was reported from our ECP that there was uh, some firing coming from inside the FOB. About uh, two minutes later, we got our first reports that uh, two coalition force soldiers had been wounded. In the eyes of all the ISAF countries, all 50 of them, were turned today to this FOB. We offer you our condolences. And we offer you our admiration as well for how you handled yourselves today in a very tough situation. There will be moments like this when you're searching for the meaning of this loss. There will be moments like this when your emotions are governed by anger and the desire to strike back. These are the moments when you reach down inside and you grip the discipline that makes you a United States soldier. And you gut through the pain and you gut through the anger and you remember why we're here. We're here for our friends. We're here for our partners. We're here for the Afghan people. Now is not the time for revenge. Now is not the time for vengeance. Now is the time to look deep inside your souls, remember your mission, remember your discipline, remember who you are, and come through this together as a unit. Now is that time. Now is how we show the Afghan people that as bad as that act was in Bagram, it was unintentional, and Americans and ISAF soldiers do not stand for this. We stand for something greater than that. We came out here today together to spend time with you, to ask you for your patience and your forbearance, to remind you who you are, to remind you that we're all together in this, not just ISAF, but Afghanistan as well. I'm proud to call him my brother. I'm proud to stand shoulder to shoulder with him in this great conflict. Because we will win. We're going to win because of you. So your sacrifice has not wasted. You are sacrifices for humanity, not just the Afghan people. You are sacrifices for people who have suffered for 33 years through the hands of such elements. It is a rewarding mission. And this enemy fighting against us is not an enemy of Afghanistan. It is the enemy of the whole humanity. So I think we are fighting together for a noble cause. We admit our mistake. We ask for forgiveness. We seek to move on. So together, as a family, shoulder to shoulder, we move on. To include the Holy Quran,